honestly, why is it hot as crap in my house? Like, I am sweating. It's even cold out today. It's raining. It's freaking raining again. It's almost July, Ohio. Stop raining. Also, did you guys see I have purple lipstick on? It matches my hat. We pretended like I've been wearing this all day. I actually have that. I took a nap until like 4 p.m. It's fine. We don't need to talk about it. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what's up? My name is Natalie. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today, you are here for part two of my college dorm haul. If you haven't seen part one yet, no fears, go ahead and click the link down in my description box below to watch part one as well. Make sure you give both of the videos a big thumbs up. Also comment your dorm necessities or what you're getting ready for back to school. I know it's super early, it's only like not even July yet, but it'll come before you know it and you gotta get the deals, gotta get the good stuff before other people take it. Also guys, I'm gonna be doing a Q&A here pretty soon, so if you have some questions that you want me to answer, comment them down below or um, DM them to me on my social medias that I have linked down below and I will do that video here within the next week or two. So without further ado, why don't we just jump right on into this college dorm hall part two and you can see the other goodies that I've picked up throughout the summer. Okay, so first thing I wanna talk about is something that I talked about in my last video when I kinda of was telling you guys my theme. So once again, I'll say it, if you haven't seen my last video, you gotta go watch it or else you'll just be lost. Not really, but I would love if you watched my last video. Um, I was telling you guys how I was gonna have like that that color theme and I was going to have an Audrey Hepburn picture. This is the Audrey Hepburn picture that I'm going to have. Um, it's black and white except for her lips and her eyelids and it says just like Audrey Hepburn down there. Sorry, I'm trying to get the ring light not hitting it but it, I don't know how well that's working. Um, and I just freaking love this. Guess where I got it? When I was in New York City, some street vendor was like selling it but it's a nice picture and I got a good deal on it because I learned how to bar barter with him bargain with him I don't know I got him to discount his price and so I got this lovely picture I got a Marilyn Monroe one as well but the glass on it broke on the flight home so your girl's got to get that fixed hopefully and might have that like in her actual bedroom when I move oh yeah guys by the way I'm moving y'all find out more about that later it's fine it's fine okay let's oh it turned on Let's get into another thing. I'm going to turn it off for this. Can I do that? There we go. Let's get into another thing that, like, is my new baby for my dorm. Everyone on YouTube raves about this. And I'm so excited to finally have it. First of all, it's going to be nice for my dorm. Second of all, it's going to be wonderful for makeup tutorials and just doing my makeup in general. I got a simple human mirror. So this has a almost like mini ring light, like what I used to light my videos around it. And this is sensor. So I turned it off now so that it doesn't like blind you guys and we don't have like a bunch of reflection issues. But it will just like light up and it's got super great mag magne magnifying, yeah, magnifying qualities and that kind of stuff. It's great for doing makeup, so I'm super excited to do this. I got 20% off of it at Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, so as you guys saw like in my first video, I showed you guys some of those canvas arts that I got. I'm obsessed with stuff like that and just having a bunch of little pictures and stuff everywhere decorating. But, I mean, TJ Maxx, they're pretty cheap to get those, but they're still pretty expensive to get like cute little pictures and stuff. I mean, I'm not about to spend like... 10 to 15 dollars to get like 10 of the I mean that's close to like a hundred dollars so first I had the idea I saw on Pinterest you could have like free downloads of cute wall art and then you put them in your own picture frame and hang them up and I was like that's such a smart idea like that's so much cheaper but then I also saw this is on better cardstock I got these at Hobby Lobby they come with let's see 12 it looks like different photos in here and it is just floral gallery art, and it was on sale for $1.99, and I got 12 of them. So, like, in here, there's that, like, flamingo one you see that says, strut your stuff. We've got, like, some stripes that say good vibes only. 
and I can like kind of zoom in here. But I'm super excited about these because I think that they'll be really nice just to hang up and I can switch them out in different, are you gonna freaking focus on my face? Thank you. I think these will be really nice just to like hang in different, um, to hang in different picture frames in my room. This next thing I got because I'm gonna miss all of my friends and my family from back home and also I'm gonna be making tons of memories with my new friends. So I got this super cute like little scattered heart photo holder and it was on sale at Target for $4.98. It was originally $9.99 so I'm gonna have just these super cute little places to put pictures and I'm probably gonna put this like on my desk that I'm making into a vanity area. <laughs> Next thing I got is for makeup. I might use this in college or I might use it at home or honestly I might go out and get more and use one for college, one for home. But they're like file organizers, but I'm going to use them to organize my palettes because right now all I have for my palettes is I have them literally stacked on top of um on top of my makeup storage and they're getting precariously tall as I'm accumulating more and I'm like this is no good and then I have to like it's like Jenga every time I try and get out a palette and it's a no good time. So I got some of these file organizers. I've seen a lot of beauty gurus do this. If you guys have a better way for storing palettes, go ahead and let me know that in the comments below. Or if you have specific file organizers that you like to use, these are just ones that I found on Target or found at Target. Um, and so I decided to go ahead and pick up these when I saw them and they're just black so they go with a lot of things. Also, I found these, I believe, at Target or Hobby Lobby, one someplace, but they were just really cute push pins. I have a cork board um, that I put photos, notes, stuff like that on, and so I just thought these would be really cute. They go with my theme. They've got some like the teals and the Tiffany blues, blush pinks, and gold, and that kind of stuff, and so I just got some cute push pins for my cork board. These next few things are pretty boring, but kind of a necessity. I got some command hooks for our room. Um, so these ones are like the li little tiny uh, damage free hanging, they're decoration hooks. So they're really tiny and they're good for hanging decorations. Like if you have tapestry or anything like that that you wanna hang up, these are what those are good for. And then I got these kind of more decorative ones. They're gold and there's four of them. And I was just thinking that my roommates and I can put this beside our door when you first enter our dorm room for coats, keys, whatever, just something right there to hang stuff up with. And then the last command product that I got were, um, they're called Small Sets Picture Hanging Strips. So they're for like eight by 10 pictures and instead of being like the hooks, they're like strips. So one side connects to the wall, like sticks to the wall and the other side sticks to your picture so that you don't have to use sticky tack or something that's not gonna hold very well or you don't have to nail anything to the wall which you're not allowed to do in your dorm room. So we're gonna try these out and see if we can use those. This next thing I have was also on sale at Target. They were originally $6.19 each and were on sale for $4.33. And they are these hangers that just have different bars on them. So you can hang over pants and stuff like that. And so you have room for like five pairs instead of just one pair on one hanger. And that's so nice, especially for college space. Um, when you're in college, you don't have the biggest closet area. So you are getting more in there for less space. Next thing I got was from Hobby Lobby and it is the ever famous little um, felt boards that everyone, like almost every YouTuber has and I really want to um, start using this in my YouTube videos when I get a better setup using this. Um, I got some little fun decals too and I just have my regular letters as well to put little quotes and stuff on. So I'm planning on using this in my dorm room. Um, or like in my background, this is probably going to be floating, just wherever I feel like having it at the moment is where it's going to be. And I really love this. I think that they're super cute. Sorry, it's a little bit messed up, but I got one of these light up boards um, and I already put in there. I think we're going to have this like in our living room area and it says dorm, sweet dorm. And when you plug it in, it just lights up. It's kind of like, you know, outside the movies where they'll have like the different titles and stuff lit up. That's kind of like what it is. And this was super cute. I think it was about $20 and it came with a bunch of the different letters so I can put whatever kind of quote I want in there. And I just really like this and I think it's going to be super cute to decorate with. 
Honestly, my roommate and I's goals are like, we want to have the most Tumblr, Pinteresty dorm room ever, and I think we're going to succeed. I'm so excited to do my move-in vlog for you guys. It's going to be so great. This would be a good time for me to tell you, if you want to see a move-in vlog, go ahead and comment move-in vlog down in the comments below. Also, while we're here talking about it, if you aren't subscribed to my channel, you're not going to know when I upload a new video. So go ahead and subscribe so you can see that moving vlog and press the little bell notification. That's going to let you know when I upload. Also, follow my social medias down below. And also, I have a giveaway going on right now. It ends very, very soon. So I'm going to link that video down in the description below. If you want to win some free makeup, go check it out. Last two things I have is one of these was actually gifted to me. And these are these ball mason jars that are spray painted gold. My friend Taylor had them at her graduation party and for like holding things and they weren't going to use them anymore. And so her mom was just asking around like, does anyone want them? And I was like, yes, yes, please. So I have four of these. They're going to be really great for storing makeup brushes or like markers, stuff like that. I'm go going in as an education major. So your girl's going to have stamps, markers, pens, everything. And makeup brushes. I mean, these are so cute for makeup brushes. They're just using and putting fake flowers in them to decorate with. So I've got four of these to do whatever I wish with. If you guys have any ideas for what I should do with them, comment them down below. Last thing is probably my most favorite decoration for my dorm room and also like the nearest and dearest to my heart. I have these floral letters. So as you can see, this one's an L and um, they spell out the letters of my name. I have N through E. For Natalie and my best friends Chloe, Ashley, and then my cousin Megan, who's also my best friend, helped me make these for my graduation party and then we're going to use them for my dorm room. So um, these were just cardboard block letters. We painted the sides yellow and then took fake flowers and like cut the stems off and hot glued them all over. So that's the N and like... This is the E here. So they're all sort of different, but when they're together, they all flow. So I'm going to have these hanging somewhere. I might just have to do the NAT, or I might have these in my actual room. I don't know yet because they are kind of big, but they're so precious, and I just really appreciate all the time and thought that my friends and family put into them. And so, like, the ones that they made, they wrote little notes on the back so that I could remember who made which ones for forever. And these are just really special to me. If you guys want to see, like, a DIY on how to make these, leave that in the comments below because it really didn't take that much time. And it was super fun. And they're super cute. Not terribly expensive. And it was just, it was great. So, thank you guys so much for helping me make these for my dorm. I really love them. Okay, that's about all that we have for this video. If you like it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Once again, make sure you check out that first dorm haul that I have linked below. And if you guys have any future video requests, go ahead and let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.